Hello everybody, this is Techno Paladin. Welcome back to some Factorio, our noob to mega base Clendathru playthrough. And I spared you some of my poor driving. I set down a box to store some resources while we went and got a bunch of bunch more. Hopefully it will be enough for us to do what I want to do. So the main thing is I want to be able to take all of this copper and build out us a nice little pad of stuff here because I want to get to the point where we can do something with it so first off we obviously have some issues with our uh, research so which is this blue cubes which is red circuits um, sulfur engines all that stuff so the main goal here is we're gonna start getting all the materials that we need to start building out the rest of this stuff here. So hopefully we can start getting all, of, oh my goodness, that takes in a lot of stuff. Uh, so we can start getting all the things that we need. So we obviously need a bunch of copper, we need a bunch of iron, a lot, a lot of iron, to be honest. Um, but uh, we're gonna start with the copper here. Since it was kind of the furthest out, we're just gonna kinda, I wanna kinda build it out so it kind of goes out this way, and then we'll have the train kind of pick up over here, uh, and then take off to the left. Um, that's kind of the goal anyway. So I just threw down a couple of these as placeholders, but I don't really need them like that. So what I want to do is I want to combine all of, all of these into four overall lines. Either that or I want to combine these down into two lines. I think I can get two lines. Maybe convert that down to two lines and then convert this down to two lines. Yeah, I think that'll work. So let's let me come up here and do this first. Um, let's uh, bring that out just a little bit. And then let's do one of these. Actually, no, that's not what we want. We just want to do that, like so, yeah? So really, I didn't need those ones there. I could, well, actually, I didn't really need these ones here. Oh, well, you know what? I'll just leave them for now. So let's bring this down. Okay, so my goal, let's go ahead and bring these together so we can get these all situated. Okay, so let's go ahead and do, ah shoot, that's not. Okay, well, we'll get that we'll get that fixed here in a second. Okay, so now let's let's try this again. I forget every time I do this, it's like throwing it down on the ground, so Yeah, turrets engage with the enemy. Yeah, well, at least they're turrets. Okay. So what I want to do is I want to start bringing it up. Well, I guess I could come in on this side. So let's do that for now. And then let's come over here. Okay. So my goal is let's, um, let's remove that for now and put the furnace down. So what I want to do, let's come back as far as we can. So I might need to bring these over here, which means destruct clear. Let's get rid of all 
these trees. All right, so we have a little bit of a gap here that I can work with. All right, let's see. So basically I want a line of copper on the top and then a line of copper on the bottom and then a return line. Let's see if we come over here. Let me space this out. So if I had that there, and Mr. Furnace here, and then our outline there, and we can do yellows out. I guess we could do yellows in, it doesn't really matter for these guys. Uh, and do I do substations with these guys or do I just do these power blocks like so? And then we can come in here. So basically I'm going to just kind of try to blueprint this out really quick. Do a quick layout. Right. Yeah, that should... Eh, well, let's just go one more so that way it gives us a connection point. All right, and then we get our output, inputs, and power. Yeah, okay. Oh wait, no, I don't want this as a blueprint. I just want to do this as copy-paste. Copy. So then let's just do Uh, dang it, no, that's doing... Okay. Let's let this build here really quick. So I think, let's see, how many is that? That's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. All right, that is slow. Yeah, it probably could help if I had more construction bots, huh? I wonder if I can... Personal robot point. I don't have any of the stuff that I would need to make that. Okay, well, I'll just let these guys put these things down. take care of this bit here at the top so so let's do this one here like so and we'll do the next one So that way, one side goes into one, one side goes into the other. And let's just get all these last bits down. Okay. So then I can come up here and let's just fix this road. Go boom. Boom. Yeah. All right, there we go. So that should start feeding into our little copper pipeline here. Let's see how this does. Because I'm not a big ratio person. If you've watched any of my other videos, you know, I, I don't really pay too much attention to ratios. Okay, I can definitely support some more. Okay. 
So let's uh, do a little quick copy paste again. But I just want. There we go. Boom. Boom. I think this is about 20, 24. So then let's do that, and then I'm going to create another one here for the other line. So basically I'm doing this instead of, uh, instead of exporting like the copper directly. Uh, shoot. Okay, you know, I'll leave that there. Yeah, well, this is a smaller mine, so that might be okay. And those are all gonna stop because I need to start getting the iron off. So, let this kind of build out. And while that's building out, let's go ahead and get our copper to be delivered here. Down. Uh, let's do this one. Let's do that one there so that way this one can come up and in like so. Yeah, there we go. let you build and then we can start figuring out our and then I can turn this into kind of a I guess I could have just used that little two by as a blueprint now I think about it you know hindsight because we can use that for the iron here coming up too okay why is that not There we go. Are all these done? Oh, I'm out of, I'm actually out? Okay, I guess I'm out of yellow inserters. I was not planning. I did not plan far enough ahead, apparently. Okay, well we can let this build. I can always go get some more yellow inserters here in a minute. We have enough copper on the on the track here that we can at least come over here and start looking at trains. Okay, so we will have two lines here. We got this one and this one. All right, and then what I want to do, let's see. We need to come down here first. Well, I'm out of power poles too. My lord. All right, let's get some uh, train tracks. So let's see. How do I want to structure this here? Let's go first. Let's go boom boom. Get rid of a few of these trees out of the way. Okay, so I do want the train to go this way when it comes and goes. So let's see if I do a 
Let's replace our Defender Drone for now. Okay, so... I need the train to be able to loop to go back around the other way. So let's do... How do I get that to... Alright, let's back this up a little bit. Really? Let's get the rocks out of the way. The tree. So I guess this is roughly how wide it will need to be. And I don't have landfill yet, do I? Uh, shoot. Did I ever research landfill? Oh, there's dirt. 20 stone, okay. Uh, oh. Yay. Um. Alright, let's come down here somehow. I should have more resources in my inventory again. See if we can't use this landfill here now. Really? I thought I killed all those bugs. Whoa. We just got a whole lot of more bugs coming in. Um yeah. Okay, yeah, we just had a whole bunch of bugs spawn in. Fun times. I thought we were going to be clear. Guess not. So let's get some of this done here. Let's see if we can't go bloop. Well, I'm obviously going to need more than that, so let's get some of these stones. Should hopefully give us what we need for this. Let's go ahead and make the landfill. And boom. Uh, nope, I guess it's not enough. get my train tracks across here. Nope. Okay. Ah, more stuff. More rocks. There's some. Uh, rocks, rocks, rocks. Okay. That 
should hopefully be enough for now. Let's see, is it enough? Yay, it's enough, okay. Okay, so now we gotta see, how am I gonna do this here? Let's do... Let's come down here a little bit. Do one of these. Okay, I guess that's too close. Come on. Basically, I'm going to create a little loop that this can, uh, this track can come off of for loading and unloading. Let's just do this here. And Okay, so that gives us, I think that's almost enough for two trains, but I don't actually have some trains on me. Dang it. Because um, what I wanted to do is maybe do... now. <laughs> Does it give me two stops, maybe? That I can use for iron pickup, if that would work. Maybe. Kind of, sort of. Let me see. Because if I take... So if I assume that this comes in here, like so... Right, and then we have steel boxes. And let's say, like so, yeah. And then I would have these two be merged together, maybe. Or does this actually give me enough room for two lines? It does actually give me enough room for two lines. So I could have that on a box, like so. So I could have two copper stations for pickup. That's, uh, let's see. But I'm obviously going to have to do some more fun because I need some grenades. And then we got the oil stop right over here, too. Oh shoot, that's going to go right into the oil, ain't it? Um, gosh dang, man, we keep getting attacked. Okay. Let me come back over here. Let me see. 
let's take a peek at what we got here. Okay, we're good. So if I have this come in here, I'm going to need another station over here for oil. And I got to have another station here for iron. And then we got more copper and stone over here that we're going to do pickups for. And eventually I need to get it all back down here. Uh, let's see. Where to go, what to do. All right, uh, hmm. decisions, decisions, decisions. Uh, well, if we come down, here, We could get to the point where I come down here and remove this and then create a line. Well, I guess we'll have to go north and over the lake there. Man, planning for trains is hard. <laughs> Uh-oh, we got some biters coming. Where are they going? We're going to have to go take out these nests, dang it. Well, let's let's see where are those little dudes going? Okay, so they got taken out at least. All right, let's um let's go dispense some some neighborly love here. Bye bye, buggies. I guess maybe if I leave one turret out, maybe it'll um, it'll prevent them from uh, spawning in. Maybe. Like, howdy, neighbor. All right, so that bug nest is gone. So I'm going to leave one turret out here and see if that helps be a preventative.
Where are these guys at? There they are. Ah. Jeez. Okay, that was close. Um, I'm gonna need some more ammo. bites the dust. All right, I'm gonna leave, again, I'm going to leave one one freedom dispenser. And okay, that should protect this side at least for now. We have some walls right here to protect us from that, so we got some big bigger nests coming. So hopefully that'll give us a little bit of breathing room here. As I try to figure out trains. Okay. Trains, trains, trains. Where do we go? Oh, you know what? I probably should put some lights down here. Give that a light. You get a light. You get a light. You get a light. I'm just gonna make sure I'm not putting it in the location where a light pole's supposed to go. <laughs> a little bit of a perk up here. Still need to go get all my materials, but we gotta figure this out. Trains! They are so much fun. Not fun. Not fun. Not. Okay. So, I obviously need some cliff explosives here. Unless uh, I can get this to curve down. So, yeah, maybe that'll work. Uh, let's do oh, I don't want it too close. I want to be able to, uh, let's say, maybe be able to put a power pole in, in the middle here. It's this one I'm going to have to rearrange a little bit. Let's take that out. to go pretty close together though. It's probably because of this this cliff here in the way. Yeah, 
that cliff. Okay. So we can do a little fun here. Try to get it back out to the level I want. No? Nah. Is that, does that work? No, dang it. Er. I guess I don't necessarily need a double station, but I gotta have it turn around. So, I mean, it kind of works for that. But I guess maybe I could instead do have this be kind of just the straight line create a nice roadway here Okay, so then if I keep this as our main one, then let's create a pole here. Let's just do There we go. That should work. So that gives us a little loop back track, and then I can actually pull off of that to come down here for a little loop back or something. this just yet, but getting it there. Okay, so we need an oil pickup here too. So let's see, so do I pull it up here? All right, so what if I do a Still getting by me somehow? How? Okay, well, I'll figure it out later. Uh, not too close.
Then let's see, what about... Can I do something like that? see how close that is to the pump jack where are you mr. pump jack there you go okay so that should be fine I'm gonna have to move that okay Do there and there for, for now. Alright, so there's a little loop back with a potential spot here for a train station for that. And while we're sitting here, I'm going to go ahead and just set up a... Set two of these guys up just because we're getting some rando attacks here. Uh, like I said, I still don't quite know how I'm going to get all this hooked up yet or where it's going to go but we're working on it so if we come down here let me uh, do let's do that Bring the power down this way so that way it's less likely to get bug attacked. Right? Okay. So then that gets us some potential. Where's. Really? Man, these guys are like really coming at us. I might have to go take these guys out. But to do that, I need ammo. So let's um, well, let's just hop in the car and go get it. It's only got 30 rockets. Maybe we'll finish this off with a bug hunt.
Oops, of course I hit the cliff. Uh, well, hopefully we have some rockets because our resources down here are getting... Ah. Alright, let's come down here. Let's hope we have some rockets. Alright, let's... Uh... Rockets. Oh yeah, we had plenty of rockets. All right, let's go. Let's go say hi to the neighbors really quick. If I can get out of my own way. this one coming from same place okay good 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 let's get up here we got our iron patch really I'm not paying attention okay let's get going this way and then we can kind of run into that tree and then that tree, and then that tree. Um, okay, so the question is, is where are they coming from? I'm going to guess it's over here at this iron patch. Alright, hopefully this doesn't mean they can make better... Uh, better dudes here. Uh-oh. Uh, ah, there we go. neighbors how are you today I'd like to talk to you about our Lord and Savior the rocket <laughs> that out there's still some attack coming don't know where they're coming from but hopefully this will free up some space let's leave one here just because and I'm glad I put built those walls where I did then <laughs> Say cliffs are fun. <laughs> Alright, let's uh wanna come over here just to check my ammo. And let these guys get repaired. Oh, there's a base right there. Okay. 
How did we not see that one? Okay, there we go. That's where they're coming from. We'll fix that. through the the spit should do it. Give us some protection for a little bit. Let's leave a little a freedom dispenser here just to help keep things uh, civilized. Alright, that should help take care of what? What's being destroyed? Oh lord. Uh, I got a little dude down there and I got nothing to defend it. Uh, walls, let's grab those two. Biters can't get it can't get a break. Just trying to get some stuff built here. Where's my car? Alright, let's come down here and take care of this biter and get some stuff set up. Besides, I need some power poles for these things, and then I need to figure out what do I do with this train? Because I gotta take it somewhere. I gotta plan out where I wanna build some stuff. Alright, let's, uh. Oh, come on. down south try not to get hit by a train try not to hit trees which yeah right Ooh. yep there goes the train <laughs> all right let's uh, set up a freedom to sponsor There we go. That should help that. Let's set one up uh, right there. Yeah, we're going to have to go get that uranium soon. That's why I want to try to figure out my train network, because we're going to get 
train is all down through here. Oh, let's go get some uh, supplies here. I need some power poles and I need some uh, yellow inserters. So let's get those yellow inserters out of the way. One, two, three, four, five, six. And actually, you know what? How much space does this, the car have? Good. Let's uh, let's get a let's just grab all of them. All right, and then let's go get some uh, power poles. Oh, all of our stuff here is almost done. All right, there's our electric poles. And yeah, we're gonna be out of stuff here soon. We can like pick all this up and rebuild new stuff. Alright, let's uh try to get out of the way here. Hopefully that'll take care of business for a little bit. Give us a break to try to get some of this stuff figured out. Really? Where are we getting hit? Okay. As long as it's over there, I'm fine. We got defenses. Like we're going to have to build some of those defenses up up here too, because... Well, there's just nothing to suck up all the pollution okay so part of what I gotta figure out is where I'm gonna build stuff so where do I need to send the trains because they're not very far I mean, we don't have much set up here, so. But I can use all this area to build in. Just have to take out some more biter nests. And, oh, yeah, we got a bunch down here now. Yay, some oil. Some more down there, there, there. Lots over here in all these trees, but. Luckily, it's blocking the pollution from them for now. So our main goal, let's see, where do we want to go? If we, like, denude this area, we can build factory floors through there. Maybe get some trains going through there. Because then we can have... Actually, I might just have one of these be the train for iron, one for copper. That way we can just, don't have to worry about this, and I can put those factories right here, the smelters. This is our oil pickup. So then we can have that come through there. So then... Yeah, I might need to go take out these guys. Especially since the pollution is getting ready to start hitting them. If I go take out these guys here, then I can get... Well, we can harvest the coal, too. We can get those guys. Mm. So if I, or I can bring it down this way. Man, the decisions you have to make to try to get this all to get laid out here. We got all this 
landmass down here that's got very limited cliffs that we can also leverage. Not much resources though. So yeah, so I think I'm going to build up. So I think maybe we can come over here and we'll start building some factories down here to do some stuff. I think that's what I'll do. So then we're going to have a train stop here for copper, one for iron, then we'll have oil around the corner. So in the meantime, though, actually, why am I not taking the car? Ooh, what the heck? That sounded like it was destroying stuff. All right, well, we may have to take care of that sooner rather than later. Dang it. Just can't leave us alone. Alright, so if this is our oil... Let's come up to about right here for now. Let's see. Uh, how do I get to my... Where's my blue? I thought I saved that as a blueprint. Did it not save? Or did I not save it? It'd be my luck I did not save it. Okay. So, looks like I'm going to have to do some of that. Get some of our defensive wall here set up. But I, I do kind of want to start setting up some solar power, though. So let's do this. Let's set up a, a blueprint for some solar power. Based on that, and then grab some of these guys, since I'm going to copy that one that I saw in the preview from the game itself. Because that looks like it's a perfect square. question is though is will because I'm not familiar with all this work so if I do that it will connect okay cool so then let's create my first blueprint for power clean energy So now let's do, boop, and we're going to call that, yeah, solar array, and create blueprint. Now, if I come in here,
Where's my blueprints? Why is that not? Wait, oh. Wait, there it is. It takes an inventory slot. Interesting. So to get this to hook into the grid, I'm going to have to probably do that, right? Yeah. So that helps it with the power. 465 megajoules production. Okay, so you definitely want some more. I'll probably use some of this space in here for power. Because why not? Okay. Well, I think I figured out a few things here for blueprints I need to get busy with. And I need to figure out, like I said, kind of what I'm going to do here. Um, and start creating some more blueprints and uh, all that fun stuff. So if you actually stuck through this whole episode, thanks for watching. I do appreciate it. Uh, make sure you subscribe if you haven't. And like or comment, any of that good stuff. And we'll get back to some more Factorio next time. So this is Techno Paladin. Thanks for watching. Good night.